Hello, everybody. It's Ares 361. Last time we finished the other dungeon, got a better sword and a few other tidbits. And this time we are going to enter Turtle Rock, which is right here. And all we have to do is press a button. That was, in, we got that collect in the collection video where I got all those different items. It's, I'll show you guys in a second. Yeah, fuzzy moment. Um, it's a quake medallion. Now, I recommend you guys get three blue potions, but I was cheap and got one green potion because it was free and a fairy. You want to have as much magic as you can, and you actually want to save them for the boss. I hate this boss. This boss is actually hard. Link, do you possess the medicine of magic? If not, I recommend you going, not going any further. But fortunately, we have it. Not like we'll need it because I know what I'm doing. But this m place is confusing if you don't have it because you actually have to use the cane of Samaria. Samaria, yes, cane of Samaria, on these question marks to make little platforms appear that you can control with your control stick. Anyway, we want to go over here and head on down here. And this room's going to be a jerk to us in a second. Okay. And we found the compass, and we're about to get killed, and, well, we didn't get Hold your sword this way so you're not looking. The reason being is if you're looking at it, there's an eye that will try to kill you, and the door will be closed. But if you hold your sword B button down to charge it, just head on out. Pretty simple. Now that we got the compass, we can head on this way, and hopefully not get killed. Keep on going. Yeah, any of those white intersection points down there, like if it's not dotted and it's kind of bold, you can move it that way, but there's no reason you want to. Anyway, you want to head in here, and a bit of magic probably should have saved that. Whatever. Nope. Uh, this is not the way you want to go. Uh, now we have to wait all the way through it, and Link's like, get dizzy, Link. You are getting dizzy. Go this way. Yes. All right. So you have those white intersection points. Okay, or a question mark, you can go the other way. Now you're going to want to get out your fire rod. And don't shoot him until, or don't fire him. All right, until you want to hit that one. That one, that one, and that one. And that will open that door. If a single flame goes out, then it will close. Now, this room, the magic cape, will be your best friend. Oh, you can't hurt me. Oh, can't hurt me again. Alrighty. And we got the map, so we can check out this dungeon. Eh, it's a little big. There is one time we have to go outside, and we'll actually get the final heart... Or, missing heart piece, and we got key. Missing, not missing heart piece, sorry. Part. Oh, dang it. Wow. Yes, yeah, so this is a very magic consum consuming dungeon, and there's really not that much magic later on, especially at the boss. The boss, you are actually required to have magic, and I fell off. Wow. You're actually required to have magic, and they don't supply you. You don't want to go in there. It's a pointless room that makes you go through it. Well, I don't think it makes you go through it, but if you go through it, you'll get a very worthless reward. You just want to head on over here and head on in. Of course you'll head on in. Now spin attack this guy. He'll die really fast. Oh, those are the green ones. I think the green ones are stronger. Get out your boomerang. These guys, I don't believe, die. You heard them. Ow. You just want to push this right here. Make a chest up here. Hit that. And that was close. Too close for comfort. Head on down here. Alrighty. Now that we're done with that portion of the game, well, the dungeon, yeah, <laughs> we're only done with a small portion of the game, and that whole four minutes, and no, that, it's not even four minutes, four, yeah, four minutes, yeah. Oh, wow, it actually gave me a fair, and he stole some of my magic. Anyway, this is where you want to head, that corner. And you will just go around in a circle for a seemingly pointless reason. 
and it was very pointless. Alrighty. Okay, grab some stuff, head on in here. You do not want, I believe it's don't go over the one on lava, yeah. That's the pointless one because we have to go there later with the big boss key if I correct. Yeah, I am. Just run for your life, I recommend. Yes, haha, -ha, you will not get me. No, I don't want to be a pink bunny. All right, much better. Die, die, <gasps> magic. And money. Out. Yeah, don't look again towards that wall. Apparently, it doesn't like me. And a key and a heart. And of course, you have to back into this. Oh dang. Yeah, barely made it. You'll be back in this really weird room. And you will end up right here where the boss key is. And we'll head this way. I'm not. Yeah, it just leads back into this room. And locks you out. And you can grab some more magic if you want. Or you could just go back. Really, either way works. If you want some magic, just go that way. Go through the. Just wait for this to do it. It's like a vacuum or something. Might as well because now we want to go over the lava. Well, we went over the lava last time, but it took a minute. But yeah, I'm like mumbling like all these things. Like, do you really just say that? And ow, 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 ow. That hurt. Stop hurting me. You're going to feel a lot of hurt in this. Okay, now if I'm correct, you want to go down? Yes. The other way leads nowhere. Now, if you head in here, it teases you like, ha ha, there's the boss key. How are you ever going to get it? And it's by going through an extremely jerkish room. What are you doing? I hate this room. Regardless, if you, if you face it, they will shoot you. If you don't face it, they will shoot you. Whatever you do, they will shoot you. All right, now actually what you want to do is in the middle of this dungeon, when we go outside, you actually want to use your mirror and we'll head on in here. Now there's two different entrances. I'm not sure. One of them has a heart piece. I'm not sure which one. This is actually just for real where we go. Yeah, that one, I don't think it's that one. Yeah, I've been through here. I don't think it was that. I think it was the other one because I don't think you can get to the other one without actually going through this part. So I know you have to go through this part. Yeah, you can't fall down right there. Can you fall down up there? Nope. All right, this is where it is. So you want to head in here and I don't like you guys. Hate you game. Uh, yeah. Guys, mimic my every move. Kill you! Wahaha! You're dead. You're all dead. And I'm going to have to shoot you guys with arrows. I think they're. What? What? You're dead. You died too. Okay, now we can head on in here. And what could it be? I've already spoiled it. It's a piece of heart! We now have all but one piece of heart, and we will actually get that other piece of heart this episode by killing the boss. Who would have guessed? Not me, says I. I don't even know what I just said. Not me, says I. Yeah, I don't know why I said that. I'm going to say that a lot. Not me, says I. No. Alright, just build the platform, and we got the mirror shield. That will allow us to reflect it. Look how big that mirror, that shield is. Seriously. Now, there is another shield. It's like, uh, I don't know what it is. It's like a fire shield. I never found it worthwhile, and it, you have to buy it. And so, I just figured I'd skip it. Anyway, head in here. And I'm trying to remember. Yes, okay. I remember this room now. I was trying to remember which way you want to go. Now, there's two options as to... W Ow! Stop hitting me! Okay, there's two options as to which way you want to go. I'm going to go this way because after this episode, I'm actually going to go and get as many arrow upgrades because arrows are useful for the final boss, as if you guys couldn't guess that by the fact that we got silver arrows. We needed silver arrows to kill him. I think you have to kill this guy. Oh, oh, the heck? 
to do? I think you have to kill all these little slimes in this room or something. So, what did you... Dang slime. Okay, you have to kill the slimes and it'll allow you to push that and pull this. And it'll open this up. And, of course, we need our magic cape. Partly. Unless you're smart. Okay. Smartness was lost. We officially need magic capes. Ow! Yeah, of course I decided not to use my magic cape. Ow! Ah, oh, yes. Sorry, trying to save magic. See how many freaking groupies I got there? I should have enough to get all the... I think you can only have 50 arrows, but... Not like you'd need much more. Maybe a few bomb upgrades. Yeah, it's like at the end of the game, I'm finally... Ow, I hate those guys. They come out of the... What's it called? Holes. And that was... Ex no, ah, I need to be in there. Go across. Yes, very Ow. Okay, now... Magic key! Yes. Alright. And we got the key that we will use in a whole five seconds. Very much appreciated, Nintendo. Alright. And we can head on downstairs. I think we're actually getting close to the boss. So. And I... Oh, no. No, 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 no. I hate this one. Okay. Admittedly... Oh, my goodness. I hate this room. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, where am I going? <laughs> Alright, you want to go down? No, I needed to go down back there. No. Aim. Go down. Go down again. Hold down. Yes. Right here is a switch. Hit it once. And then you want to go on all the way around here and get hit. And you'll see that's where we're trying to get to. Nope. Dang it. Go back. Yes, go back. I want to go up and straight on over. And voila, we're out of that horrible room. There's so many places you can go in that room and it's annoying. Charge! Yeah, that was really smart to me. Okay, charge and stop. And it hit him off and I didn't get hurt. And oh no. Oh no, 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 I don't like this room. Charge, 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 charge. I am leaving. I do not care what you guys say. This LP is over because I don't like this room. Alrighty. What I'm going, what you want to do is, this is actually another part I forgot about, is if you get to this part, it's going to be annoying because there's all those laser guys in that room, but fortunately we've got the mirror shield. Don't fall down there, that would be horrible. But you want to head down these stairs and we will actually be in a... F find a few fairies that will respond every time you walk in this room and some ripples. Oh, wow, a whole half a heart. I don't give that big of a care. All right, no, don't run. I don't want to fall down that hole. Okay, much better. Now, this following room, I highly don't recommend you go and get the other treasure chests than the ones required and the only one required is the one at the very end so you want to you want to fall off yes you want to turn immediately see it'll protect you only problem is yeah all right the rest of them will give you ripple the closest one to the door we just went through is a green one the next closest is a blue one and then the furthest is a red one, so it kind of gets more valuable. And we're actually, I think, yeah, the boss is just up the stairs. Wow, we're close, man, guys. Oh, no, 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 anti-fairy. And if you look at my health, you will notice I lost that much from that room. I'm not even kidding. You stole my magic again. Stop stealing my magic. No, stop. I said stop. I said stop. And it's still. Did you take all my magic? Oh. Yeah, I hate this. I swear, it's like the magic dungeon. What should we do for this dungeon? We should drain all their magic. <gasps> That's a great idea. Just don't waste all these pressure. Oh my goodness, anti fairies. Alright. 
You guys just like to haunt me or something? Seriously. Oh, dang it. Get these dang. Get that dang. Everything is dang, dang, dang. Oh no. I don't know what the dang you're talking about. Dang. Guess I got a little bit of magic. Just a little bit. Don't want too much. Just a little bit. Alright, get the bomb. Head down these stairs. Oh, it's not up. Down. And finally a bit of magic. Uh, I think we'll be fine. I got one fairy. Yeah, I got one fairy. Don't want to bother going back and trying to get an anti-fairy and wasting all my magic and all that fun stuff. Because you're going to want your magic. Now, first thing you want to do is pull out the fire rod. Trust me on this. Welcome to the turtle boss. Now, I'm pausing it right here because I'm going to explain this boss. There are three heads. The middle one you cannot do anything about. The other two are the red one is a fire head, which you have to hit with the ice rod. The blue one is the ice head, and that you have to hit with the fire rod. Now, the ice one will change the floor, and the fire one will just burn you if you touch the fire it shoots. You want to get the ice one killed first because it will change the floor for the whole battle and that can be annoying after you get to part two of the boss. So once you hit it with the fire rod, just slash it with your sword. You'll see in a sec. And it comes out. And yes. And then you just want to hit it with your sword as much as you can. And once it goes blue again, this is... It's dead already. Nice. Yeah, you want your magic for this, especially if you're not using the sword. Uh, I'm actually going to use my blue potion right here. Because I seriously don't want to waste my one fairy, and I want to get a bit of magic back. Pull out my ice rod. Oh, wow. Dang it. Hit him. Hit him. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I'm actually not able to show you guys. But... Wow, I didn't have the... Extra heads. Yay, we beat him. No, we didn't. Spoiler alert. He wasn't really dead. Yeah. I didn't actually have the two heads. Yeah, he turns out to be some kind of snake. You want to hit his weak point, I believe? Oh, wow. I am doing horrible. I didn't practice this part of the boss because I died. Yeah, you want to hit his weak point. Get away from him. Oh, dang. Oh. Our one fairy is now being wasted. Okay, I'm going to make sure to watch my health meter. I'm kidding. And the boss music restarts. Oh, what? No, 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 no. I think I'm about to die if I do not get this. No. Nope. Yes. Heal, heal, heal. Right. Oh, no. Dang it. Yeah, it hurts three, I think. Yes, two hits of a spin attack with the golden sword will kill him. He's dead. Finally dead. Take that. The last boss that is not the final boss is dead. And we got our 20th heart container and none other than a crystal. But who's in the crystal? It's none other than... This time be on cue, please. It's none other than... It's none other than Zelda! <laughs> Finally. <laughs> I appreciate you coming this far to rescue me, as I thought you are the legendary hero. I felt this from the first time we met. Ganon is waiting inside the tower to pass through the gates, linking the two worlds. Once Ganon enters the light world, it is unlikely that anyone can stop him. But if, it's, if he stays in the closed space of this world, you can find him wherever he runs. Now, go to the Tower of Ganon. We will use our combined powers to break the barrier. Let's return peace to the country without fail. Do you understand? Not at all, because I wasn't paying attention. Yes, we do. May the way of the hero lead to the trip. And she says that too. And now we are pretty much fully... Like, seriously, we're like super powerful Link. Yeah. We are the almighty powerful Link. Okay. So, I think I'm going to end it off right here. 
next episode we will probably go through either all of Ganon's Tower or the first half. We will find out next episode because I really don't know because I haven't practiced it. And I will be before I record next episode and all that. And then we will do the finale, which is pretty much the final boss fight. So I will see you guys then when we head in Ganon's Tower's Castle or whichever one Nintendo happened to want to name it. Alrighty, see you guys then.